Now let's take a look at the concept of time series. As the title suggests, it is actually the series of time. So it is actually a sequence of data points of an event or process which is observed at successive points in time. Now data points are often collected at regular intervals, though it is not necessary and it constitute a sequence of discrete metrics that characterize changes in the series as the time progresses. Let's take an example of the bash commands that are entered into the command line. So now data points are not likely to be equally spaced in time. This means like one command is given two seconds before and the next command is given in five seconds before. So we are not concerned with the duration that is coming between two intervals, but we are considered with the event that is occurring at that particular data point. So the series is event driven where each event is an executed command in the shell and each data point is associated with the time of a corresponding event occurrence. This time series is very important in the context of anomaly detection.